hey everybody, Anne here, and today I'm going to show you how I make Camp Cherry Pie. It's super delicious, only uses three ingredients, and you can do it on a grill or even over a campfire. All you need is two pie crust, one can of cherry pie filling, some sprinkled sugar, an old-fashioned bread maker, or even an omelet maker. I'm pretty sure you could make it in that too. So just spray the bottom of the pan, put the first pie crust in the bottom of the pan, drape it over the sides, pour in your cherry pie filling, put the second crust, or even just half of the crust, in the bottom, fold it over, crimp it, and then cook it. Okay guys, I don't know how this is gonna turn out. I don't know if it's gonna work. See, I've got the pie in there and the idea is to turn it over now and hopefully it won't stick and the other side will be lightly browned. I don't know. Nope, that's not the sizzling sound I wanna hear. Oh my God. Oh, perfect. All right, I'm gonna let it go for a few minutes and then we'll see how it turns out. Right on. And I almost forgot to tell you, I poke holes in the bottom crust like you see there so that it kind of bakes evenly, the air can vent. Let's see if the last flip did its job. That looks good. I'm gonna flip it back over. Oh, please be good, please be good. Oh, it's good, but it's not done. Let's give it a couple more minutes. Right on. Flip it over one last time. Yeah, I think that's done. I think that's good enough. Well, I don't know. No, that's still kind of gummy. You know what? I'm gonna let it go for a little bit longer. What the heck? How that's puffed up, I'm not gonna turn it over because I know the, the underside is done now. I'm gonna take it over to a table and we're gonna cut it up and see if it tastes good. Um, how am I gonna get this? I'm gonna put a little bit of sugar on it. This isn't actually sugar, it's Splenda. I don't like too much sugar, but I think this will make it taste even better. I can't wait to cut it open. I'm gonna cut it open right by here. It's just gonna be like a cherry pie. Oh my goodness. Look at that, guys. Oh, the crust is gonna be good. All right, I need to get a spatula or something and plate it up, and then we'll see how it tastes. I'm excited. It should come right up. Oh, please let this be good. I'm gonna kind of cut into it a little bit. And this is just exactly like a cherry pie, basically. And let me taste it myself. Mmm, hot. Mm. Oh my God. Mm-hmm. This is good. All I did was, in my bread pan, I have made cornbread in it. It's old fashioned, you, it's, they're very hard to find. Um, I just took two pie crusts, put one in the bottom, and uh, kind of put part of another one in the top while I put the cherries in. And then um, put the crop pie crust together, kind of crimped it, and then I cooked it over the grill. You cook it about five minutes on, uh, about seven minutes on one side, flip it over, cook, for, cook it for another seven to ten minutes just depending on how hot the coals are. And you end up with campfire cherry pie. I did sprinkle a little sugar on it. Oh my God, guys, it's so good. Thanks for watching, everybody. I hope you enjoyed the video. Make sure you like, subscribe, hit the bell, and y'all have a good one.